Yo, look at that pig. Look at that pig out here. Just he just that pig is just roaming. I just arrived in Palenque. Thank you. The first town, the first village of the America. Also, this name, this town is this village is named Africa out of Africa. Huh? The singer. Okay. Alfredo is the man who created like a band. Oh, this is him. Oh, what's up, man? <laughs> In our community, we are so afraid of COVID-19. My name is Hassan El Sadiq, entrepreneur, filmmaker, and now I'm traveling around the world, connecting with people about their dreams. Eating the food with the locals and learning about the culture. see there. Welcome to my new series, Citizen of the World. Welcome to my new show, Citizen of the World, where I travel the world and talk to people about dreams. I eat the food with the locals and I learn about the culture. Welcome to Citizen of the World from Cartagena, Colombia. I've been wanting to embark on this journey of traveling the world for a long time. With the first We All Have Dreams movie complete, now is the time. I just got in the car with Abraham, which today is going to take me to Palenque and translate for me so I can learn about the culture of Palenque. A friend told me about a village named Palenque outside of Cartagena, Colombia, which is the first free African town of the Americas. Yes, you heard me correctly. Palenque is the first free African town of the Americas. You're probably asking, what does that mean? Well, Cartagena is a port city. And during the slave trade, Spaniards introduced kidnapped and enslaved Africans to South America. Ships full of Africans arrived to be bought and sold before the next trip to North America, where most of our African-American descendant relatives became slaves here in the United States. The Palenque community began in 1619, when Bankus Baho led a group of about 30 runaways into the forest and defeated attempts to subdue them. What makes this so interesting to me is that if they were captured, they would have probably been killed or they would have possibly been shipped to North America for the transatlantic slave trade. The world and find other dreamers that have a goal or ambition. And, uh, so we just arrived here in Palenque. And we're getting ready to meet our guide so he can show us around the town and um, you know, help us learn about the culture of Palenque. So that's what we're about to do right now. It's a little bit down there. Up until this point in my life, I've only seen places like this on TV. But TV will give you a distorted depiction depending on the agenda. The only way to increase my knowledge is to have the experience in person. And it was an anxious feeling when I arrived. I'm gonna learn a little bit of history about Palenque, as you can see. This is like his own world of people and very, very different from anything that I've experienced. Just every day being an American, I was so far removed from my African roots. How you doing? Hey, how you doing, man? I'm well, man. My name is Hermie. I'm a local guide to this community. So welcome to Palenque, the first free village of the America. Palenque, the first town, the first free village of the America. Also this name, this town is, this village is named Africa out of Africa. Africa in Colombia. Africa in the Americas. Also declare patrimonial and intangible, you know, of Africa heritage by UNESCO. And today we are going to know about our own history, about our own culture, and a dear little thing more. Here you will see part of our own handcraft, you know, souvenir, different thing more, you know, and here we are in the main square. The main square is where we really say where we make the drone festival every year October 12th. We are coming many people to enjoy the drone festival, to enjoy the typical candies, to enjoy about the drum and our originally from, from here. Yeah, I was born here. He was born here. Yeah, I was born here. 
So how, did, how did you how did you, how do you speak so much so good English? Yeah, my English I learned in the streets, bro. I read book by myself, looking for the internet. You know, listen money rap, American rap. Uh, you know, who's your favorite? You know, I said my favorite. I have Pac, I have Nas, Tupac. You know, I know some of those rap against the rap like Fifty Cent. How is everyday life here? Like you know, just you know, I live from about the gastronomy, mm -hmm. agricultures. Yeah. You know, we have a very personal guy. Because when we finish this the scholarship, when we finish the school, sorry, mm -hmm. we as children we go to the primary school. We go to higher school. When we finish the higher school, we have the right to participate in the tests. If we win the test, we have the right to receive a scholarship in the state in, in the state there in the some city of Colombia, mm -hmm. studying, you know, or you know, working there, you know, trying to get an opportunity. This is how many guys of this community made personal by themselves. They come to visit some family, you know. They come to bring money. We have many, many people in this community, many personal guy, teacher, lawyer, and lawyers, oh. you know, working outside this community. You know, sometimes they come here to support their family, the busy thing. This is how we live here. Cemetery. Cemetery of Palenque, no, we, where we really say, that's it, the cemetery will start our own religion. We have our own religion in this community. And what 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 is the religion? What what's the religion? The name of the religion is Lumbalu religion. Okay. It's a religion that we practice only when somebody passed away in the community, when somebody died. Okay. For example, if somebody died today, then the next day or the same day, many, many, many friends of different sectors go to visit that person and at the house of that person and die. Okay. And uh, the next day, we come to bury that person. Okay. You know, to bury the person. Still, many friendships go to visit the, the family of the person that died. Right. You know, they are making like a funeral. Funeral, many old women crying. Right. Only the women keep keeping like a crying more and more. Some friends gonna cry, but more as are the old women and okay. going to start to make that Lumba Lu practice. Okay. You know, the Lumba Lu practice it commemorates and like a night night we celebrate to commemorate uh, like a night night. Right. It's in commemoration to the nine months that the women carry a baby inside. Mm. Yeah. Okay. That's represent us. Okay. So in America, a lot of people pass away yeah. through gang violence and things like that. Yeah. Young, yeah. not supposed to, you know, not supposed to yeah. before their time. Yeah. Generally here, do, are the people that pass away like older? Yeah. You know, like, do they, no, do they have... Yeah, another word, something like this? You know? Yeah, like, you know, like, just do they do they become old men and pass away? Yeah. Instead of, like, like, like young people, violence and things like that. Yeah, the, uh, listen, the crime here is low. Here we live about more people die about the... Yeah, it's like, like the natural things, you know, like... It's like I have an immunization of young people dying before their time. But it's not like that everywhere. Some discussion sometimes happening here in the community too. Some discussion there. and then like this, but we try to reparate the problem by by ourselves. Right. We reparate our own problem by ourselves. You know what I mean? You know, we have our own rules. Mm -hmm. Our own rules. We have our own law. We don't have a particular policy here. We are part of the government of Colombia, but we have our own government. We have our own rules. Right. Our own police. Our own, you know, our inspector. We have our own. You know, lawyer, we have I want, to, I want to explain you here in Palenque, we don't have uh, police, we don't have a particular police. Mm. We have our own police. Name is Sima Rungar Police, the Sima Rungar Police. That's me. Sima Rung me. Alfred descendant, which is escaped from the hand of the European conquerors to live in the jungle, in the hills, to be independent. Mm. That's the meaning of this. Police is the only member that was born here in the community. We have no particular police. We don't want a particular police. Our own police carry a stick. They don't carry a gun because we don't believe in shooting our own people. You know, we don't believe in shooting our own people. But we try to live like a brother, to get it all the time. That's what we do. And I'm listening to him, and I'm just torn. In my head, I'm thinking, just how do we get so far away from these values? Yeah, how, how did Palenque start? Listen. 100% of the people that live here in this community are Afro-descendant people. We come from different parts of the Western for Africa. 
like Guinea Bissau, Congo, Angola, Senegal, Ghana, more Western, part of Nigeria too, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. more is like West of Africa. Right. Many European conquerors went to part of Africa. The way, the, 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 the way, the way does they win there is because the riches, right. the mineral, the gold. Right. They take and also they take part of us to make it a hard work. We didn't know how to deepen you know, against them. They they take it as they take it out to make it a hard work and to say like, you no, know, if you don't do, you don't make what we're going to. If you don't do what we're going to say, you, you know, they will kill us. Right. We feel like obligated to make the word that they were telling about. Mm -hmm. But we never want to be a slave. They obligate us to make a slave. Right. To be right. a slave. Sorry. To be a slave. They obligate us. You have to do this. You have to move like this. Or, or we're going to kill you. Right. So, and then. If you go to the different European country, they take part of us and they share different parts of the world. Mm -hmm. They share us, you know. If you go to the different country like Holland, England, France, you will find many are from Afro descendant colony. Mm -hmm. It's not because actually they are traveling there. Right. That's happening, that's coming generation and generation that's happening because they they sell us to the different countries to make the hard work. Right. After right. now. The city of Cartagena was one of the first slave port in the Caribbean. Mm, okay. And in Cartagena is where it starts. I mean, Papa, you know. say, yeah, Papa. And in Cartagena, in Cartagena is where it starts. It's where it starts part of our own strategies mm -hmm. to escape from the hand of the European conquerors. Right. Why not that strategy? When we arrived there, we arrived there in the city of Cartagena with the idea that how we're going to do to scale, how we're going to, to do to, to be free. Right. With us, with us came a leader. It's a man, it's a king, a king that came from the island Bissau, Guinea Bissau. Guinea Bissau. That's South Africa, Western Africa. Uh -huh. This man's name is Ben Cosby Hall. So this man and all the guys arrived, keep it together, you know, keep together, you know, and in Cartagena trying to make plants. Oh, sick okay. or sick or eight of them. But anyway, the idea was to escape or escape. They escaped, they, they came from the city of Cartagena. Okay. They came walking around, they say dance murder, nothing. Dance care, now we need to be free. We are human people, boy. We are human people, too. we need to be free. We had on again how to defend, but we we knew how to move in the jungle, how to use the strategies, the big powers that was given by our African gods. Right. All that strategy was useless. That's African gods, and we use it like Elwa, Chango, Jemaja, Oshun, that's the name of the different African gods. They helped us to escape from the hand of the European conquerors. They came walking around, they say that's my how one day. All the day we are going to keep walking around, sleeping on the jungle, sleeping on the tree, and from the tree watching the enemy coming behind us. Uh -huh. They say we need to be free. Because also, those Afro descendant guys, they knew how to dominate a wild animal and put all those wild animals against to the enemy. Correct. Like a snake, wild dog, and the different things. Correct. Yeah, they can't walk around. You see, Cartagena is so far. And, and the car is one hour, one hour and 20 minutes. But yeah. if you come walking, walking around, <laughs> far, walking. They, they say dance murder. Yeah. Two, three days, one week, walking around, they come, they found this place. Right. Why they choose this place? Because this place was very high. Right. Very, very high right. of the enemy from the city of Cortez. We found this place. And when they found this place, they came, they came back to the city of Cartagena to look for more Afro descendant brothers to bring, to bring here. To bring here, okay. The guys explain the women how is the route, how is the way. Mm -hmm. They explain the route is like this, the route is like, and, the, and the women say, okay, we have a power. Also, we worship by a power by our own, by our own African God. Right. And the many people say, what is? What is many Afro descendants? What is the power? We know how to create a map, just explain us. And they start to explain to the women how was the route, how was the way to come here. And the women create a map in the higher tiles. They create a map. Uh -huh. We made a group with the 14 people, 12 people, and every group include two or three women. They said, well, how we bring more people and more people to here? Right. The women say, follow us. 
we know what is the way, we know, we know what is the destiny, we know where we go, don't worry. So the women helped yeah. as well. Yeah, we, we call us the natural magic of our own black women. And also we call us like the root of the freedom made by our own black women. Right. After hearing this story, my self-esteem immediately went to a higher level of pride. I can explain it as this. If I was in Africa learning about my heritage, I would be excited to learn where I come from. But the pride of hearing this story was that the people of Palenque also come from African heritage, but escaped and hundreds of years later still maintain their way of life without disruption. The key word is escaped. They took that risk to be free and it's so much honor and strength that comes along with that. Another key word for me is the word free. It's 2022 and I'm not sure if I am really free. Free, which is defined as not costing or charging anything. So are we really free? Who like who owns these these houses? Do you do say say I'm from Palenque, right? Yeah. And I want to I have my family. Do I just build a house? To build how does how, how do, yeah like how does that work? So just say you. Yeah. For you, so you so you say you so yeah yeah so so yeah house. yeah so say say you were li you were living with your your father and your family right? Yeah. So now you have your own family. Yeah, I got do my own you, family. Do you build your own house now? No, I, but I'm trying to. I got my own my own um on backyard where I built where on ground where where I have my own ground. Right. Where I build the house and now I'm making my money. Mm -hmm. I'm making my money because I, I want to to build my own house. Maybe oh. maybe they yeah. want to know. Yeah, I'm working for that. Como como tienen la tierra. Yeah, but you know. Yes, my work. My, for example, one of my father. Yeah. I, I got my father. My father have many family here. And it's all not then, like every family of this community have their own land. Right. That's that. Yeah. That's what. I, that's that's what. I, that's and what every, I'm asking. Every of that family can give devils. And for example, I have uh, my father have a different brothers, and right. maybe one of that brother can give uh, for for they they nephew sons. And you know, okay, my nephew can have this because he's part of the family. That, that's how we go for our land. Right. And then so we are the family. And then you, then who builds the houses then? You know, we work. Right. When we are independent, we have the right to go and work and so on of the family. For example, my father have a good work. He can help. And my mother have a good work. He can help his sons, his his daughters to build, uh, you know, their house. And, and also the, his daughter and his son can uh, collaborate and uh, to help. To, to build. To, yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Do a lot of people like want to stay here in Palenque to live their life, or do, or is it a goal to, wow, to, to, yeah, is it yeah. a goal for like the young, the young people to achieve something more by going out into the world? Like, yeah, some people leave uh, this, this, his land to go to get a uh, better life or their family. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, they go to work to, some of them go to work to bring money for their family. Right, you know, and all the feel like. You know, for example, me, I'm working about the tourism. Sometimes I go to work in Cartagena, mm -hmm. but I'm coming back, right. you know, to bring uh, my money for my family too. Right. Um, but I'll keep it more here in Palenque working. Right. Yeah, for example, right. me, I'm going to be here in Palenque. This is this is a, a sector that is named Chopacho. This right here is Chopacho. Chopacho? This is a name of this sector. Chopacho is, 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 name, is, is also named like the, the sector of the drummers. The sector of the drummers. Yeah, because here they say that here was where the stake. So I bought. I live for here. I'm gonna show you where I live now. I'm humble house. Okay. Yeah. It's, they say that in this sector was where was where the stake. Oh, that's tribe. That tribe in the back in the day, our ancestors. The tribe. The tribe were the stake. All the guys who knew how to play the drums mm -hmm. in this area. They you stayed know, in this area. This area yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Because you know the drum was our first our first meet of communication. Uh, I didn't drum. know that. Yeah. Was the, was the first sound that we used in the back in the day to use to play the drum. And when the enemy was trying to come and get inside the community, we played the drum to honor our own brother when they want to come inside. Right. Yeah. How how does school work here? Like school? Yeah, so the but so the kids so seasons. they have different seasons, you know. Okay. You know, different like uh, 
uh, they have uh, different hours to work. Okay. For example, some of the children go from uh, seven o'clock in the morning. Mm -hmm. They finish at one around uh, like uh, one o'clock in the afternoon. Okay. And then go to another another part of children. Okay. Okay. To start again, they go and they finish around at five o'clock in the afternoon. Another day, the same thing. Ah, uh, okay. That's how they work. Okay. In the high school is the same thing. Look at my little daughter. And this is my kid. These your kids? Yes. Oh wow. Sure. Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> That's my little girl and my kid, soccer player. I see. Yeah. Obviously, they, they, want, they want to play some soccer, huh? That's why he might, he likes many, many soccer players from France, you know, after the time, like in Mbappé. You're about that soccer play, I'm telling like, you. Like, you know, they do like this, but you part of one group. Oh, uh, <laughs> that team has a soccer. And, uh, who in the team has a soccer in here? Yeah. Here, Allah. No, they get out of there. That's my nephews, and that's my, my little girl. <laughs> yeah, so this, that's the house where I live. Well, this kid is. He, you watch the basketball games here? Yeah, I play. I play. Both like the basketball. Yeah? Yeah, I got likes the basketball. They yeah, play basketball. My, my, my kids like to play soccer. Yeah. They like to play, you know, basketball. That's yeah. what I represent. You saw the guy who gave me some money over there? Yeah, yeah. Because he was giving me that because we are making money to fix the some hook that we have there in the main square. Oh, yeah, let me see. Yeah, now we're going to see that. Right. When I'm not working, I come to the, you know, this is the corner where we keep it all the time. Okay. You know, Shannon, you know, where all the guys. This, this is where, this is, this is the corner where, where, where the where guys kick it. Keeping, you know, killing him, talking about different things, you know, all the you know? Right. <laughs> yes, right. See, so you got the mics on. Yeah. Mics is international. Yeah. Even, in, even in Palenque, they got the mics, man, you know? You know, they got the breads even in even in Palenque. Yeah. What are you saying? <laughs> that's what they do. <laughs> oh, power up. Okay, that's right. I well, I we had the, the 23 in there. Yeah, I see. Yeah, yeah. Shh. Come on, man. Come on, man. That's where I look. Mm -hmm. That's where I look, you know. Oh, Mike. 23. I make films about people that have dreams and aspirations. Mm. That's, you know, so I go, go, go across the country the united states talk to people that have dreams mm. and they tell me their dreams and their aspiration what they want to do with their life well, yeah, 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 so i'm asking you yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what what's your wildest dream if you if you if you you know what i want what would it be yeah i want i want to be at first i want to be a good, good father for my two sons I wanna be a good husband for my wife, you know. I wanna prepare, I wanna prepare a good future for my sons. That's what I want I wanna dream. And I want I'm going to prepare my sons to prepare the future of their sons. I wanna teach everything. Legacy. Yeah, legacy, you know. Legacy. That's right. That's what I want. This is part of my dream. Yeah, like what would be your dream? Occupation in order to create the legacy for your family. Yeah, um, I wanna yeah, I wanna help my my, 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 my two children in a university. Okay. I wanna help them. I wanna that's me. I wanna help them to make professional guides. Right. Professional guides. I wanna be a, a, a player. I wanna he 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 be he be the, the best. One of the best players. My daughter is the same thing. It's tomorrow he wants, my little daughter is wanna be like a doctors or nurse. I wanna, I want them to help to prepare. Even though this is a new journey telling stories outside of the United States, everything circles back to we just all want the best for our families and children. Now, you are dreaming. Your, your dream. Yeah. My dream to work hell and get many, 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 many. Many money for support them because I got that. Now I, that's what I'm working. Right. I'm working for that. 
I want to be now. In the moment, I got 23. I got in, in the moment. I, I I'm, I'm 39 and 36 years, 37 years. I wanna got my own house, my own big house. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I was with it there, here in Palenque. Here in Palenque. And then it's, you know, I wanna make better things, you know. You know, I wanna they growing up in their in their own property. Right. And they say like uh, my father fought and a fault for me. Right. And now they I want and they feel like a pro for all I want I want I want I want to do man. Our dreams, whether it be to become whatever we want to become always comes back to we all just want to push our families forward. This episode of Citizen of the World is sponsored by All Dreams. Believe and achieve all dreams. And this is what All Dreams is all about. Look, somebody didn't dunk, took the, took the, took the joint down. Young guys like to play basketball Yo, out here. We have a group in the, in the internet. Hey, we're going to play today. Everybody come in tonight, 7 o'clock, everybody in here. Yeah. Jordan Sewer and everything. Like, <laughs> like, we're going to play. All Dreams is about making impact in any way we can, small or big. And if I see a need or have an idea through connecting with the people that I meet, I want to take action. While in Palenque, I seen that the basketball hoops were all torn down. And what I want to do is I want to buy new sturdy outdoor basketball hoops for the village. Purchase our All Dreams Juneteenth Big Elephant Dreams hoodie to contribute. And I will make a video when we purchase and install the hoops in Palenque. Back to our regularly scheduled program. One of the singers of this community, one of the singers. Okay. His name is Afro Neto. He's a man who created like a band. This man created like a group of, of the maker for glory rap. Right. This guy created like a group. Uh, name, the name of the group, his name is Kombile Sami Group. Mm -hmm. Kombile Sami, his name is name, his, his name of our own language. We have our own traditional language too. Okay. His name, Kombile Sami, means my friends. Okay. And they are they have they are like a nine member in a group. Mm -hmm. They come in making many the rap that they make it is they make they make with the traditional instruments. Right. This is the only that how they they rap and this is why we that is why we call folklore rap hip hop. What's this? It's about the the dream. Yeah, it's really good history about the that dream. Yeah. Like it's a, a typical dream. Yeah, it's typical shop in our head. This right here? Yeah, the city of Grand. Look at that group, you know, different album record. Yeah. Is that, is that? Yeah, it's, yeah, it's him, Fernando, right there. These are uh, the female boys of the group. Hello. The female boys of the group. Oh, wow. She's in the group? Yeah, she's part of the group. And she's the wife of Fernando. Oh, the man, we created it, but yeah, she's the wife. Oh, Where's wow. Her? Show me where is her right there. Okay. okay, well, I, yeah, she's right there, but I, she's right here, too, though. Yeah, she's right here. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, man. Yeah, wow. And this is the house, and you see some of the group come to last time, look at that right there, for a band. Oh, man. Is this where, this where they make the hits at? Huh? Yeah, yeah, it's his name, man. This, 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 this where they make the hits? Yeah. It's Afro Neto. It's Afro Neto. Oh, it's him. It's him, yeah. Oh, what's up, man? <laughs> Yo, they got you all over. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. Que represento por por el trabajo que vengo haciendo, tú me entiendes? For the world that he come and doing that, the way he represents for the music. Por, music, por la identidad, music, estoy difundiendo la cultura palenquera yeah, ante walking, Colombia y el mundo, si walking, me entiendes. Walking about our own culture sí. inside this town and inside Colombia and the world, sí. you know, all over the world. We're También aquí trabajo con niños, con jóvenes, enseñando todo lo relacionado also, con las manifestaciones culturales. Por eso soy como un joven representativo That's de why. país. I'm a young guy representative here in Palenque. Sí. 
Esta es la sede del grupo donde trabajamos con la música, los diferentes instrumentos, tambores alegres, llamadores, marímbula, tambores, Este es el nombre de la banda, con Viles Ami. Con Viles Ami quiere decir mis amigos, my friends. Y estos son los integrantes de la agrupación. Esta portada corresponde al primer trabajo discográfico que se llamó Así es Panay. This is the first. This is the. Yeah, this is the first record. record. Name it. Yeah. Palenque. Name it. How Palenque is. Yeah. And this other one corresponds to the second work of discography that was called Esa Palenquera. Okay. And we're there on the different platforms, digital, Spotify, iTunes, SoundCloud, YouTube, different platforms. And we've been able to do different cities of Colombia and other countries. Eh, Bogotá, Cartagena, Barranquilla, Bucaramanga, Cali, Medellín y a nivel de país eh, también Venezuela, Cuba, México, Panamá, USA, también Chicago, Massachusetts, Washington DC, eh, Lincoln Center, Kennedy Center, también Nueva York, eh, Tiny Desk, NPR, yeah. sí. representando ahí, claro, en el wow. Y de aquí, de Palenque para el mundo, tú sabes, representando siempre. When he started the group, what was his vision? Like, did he, did he believe it would get this big? Ah no, hay una hay una visión clara cuando empezamos y era mantener la cultura, si me entiendes, especialmente la lengua a través de la música. Eh, pasaba algo que era que, bueno, muchos jóvenes y niños le gustan otros ritmos, otros géneros musicales. Rap, trap, reggaeton, afrobeat entre otros y descuidaban un poco lo tradicional claro, los ritmos y sones tradicionales entonces lo que hice fue unificar como una fusión entre estos géneros populares y los ritmos y sones de palenque to enclose all the guys inside that claro. yeah. y no hacerlo de pronto los beats o las pistas con este, como yeah. no digital only, eh, no only to make the sino beats con los instrumentos de acá guitar. si me entiendes no. it was like a, to make a beat with our own instruments claro claro y rapear y, y cantar rap, en lengua palenquera porque a través de la música es una manera de perpetuar como de mantener de guardar esa, music, ese legado si the music is the, is the, the, the best way to transform to keep in life all that cultural heritage claro de mantener did, did he believe that, it would, that he would travel the world doing it yeah uh, como cómo te mantuviste así como tú hiciste para viajar eh, ah ¿no? bueno lo, lo primero fue que we, como fuimos a Bogotá ¿se ¿sí me entiende? First primero we went, we went fuimos a Bogotá first. como que fue nuestra primera presentación así nacional in, y national, ya luego ahí otra then, gente nos vio y dijeron como esto lo tiene que conocer el mundo si me entiendes claro y entonces dijeron como hay festivales en Panamá hay festivales en Venezuela hay fiestas en Cuba en México y así fuimos como para diferentes lugares de, de Colombia y, de, y, del, y del mundo ¿sí? Y bueno, ya también cuando pudimos como reunir algo de dinero, decidimos irnos a Estados Unidos. Porque fuimos como muy influenciados por los afroamericanos raperos. Sí, como... So this is the date. 
So they have Baltimore, yeah. Salt Lake City, New York City, yeah. Peter, Petersburg, New York, Chicago, yeah. Santa Fe, Mexico, Albuquerque, yeah. New Mexico. Hello, yeah. where are you from? Buffalo, New York. Yeah. Uh, Portland, Maine. You can go and see that too. Absolutely, I'm coming. New Hampton, uh, Massachusetts, Queens, New York. Yeah. Y nuestra música habla de los diferentes temas sociales, culturales. Different social. Sí. Things, you know, you yeah. know, preservation of the medio ambiente. You know, of, uh, all the, uh, our health. You know. Sí, claro. Hablamos de la unidad también, de la unión, sí, no más violencia, no más racismo, no más discriminación. Sí, es como tratando de darle soluciones a diferentes problemáticas en la comunidad y en Colombia, incluso en el mundo. Would he say that he's living his dream you right know, now? Como, como, tu vive tu sueño, o sea, como, o sea, que tu piensa que tu estás viendo los sueños tuyos ahora, o sea, que tu piensa de eso. Pues sí, eh, yo siento que sí, eh, estoy ya cumpliendo parte de mi sueño. You know, he feel like he you know, accomplished that part of their dreams. Yo, um, yo, yo tengo muchos sueños, sí. Many dreams, y estoy cumpliendo uno de ellos porque, bueno, pude crear como un nuevo estilo musical. Pude, pude crear un nuevo estilo musical que sirve para las nuevas generaciones. It's really good for new generation. Y para los músicos también aprender de él. No sufre, no de muchos young guys to learn about that gender. Yeah. Pero un sueño también que tengo. But another dream that I have is que lo cumpliré cuando eso que lo cumpliré cuando con mi trabajo gane dinero es hacer una universidad aquí porque te toca irte a Cartagena a Barranquilla a Bogotá y eso te desconecta de la cultura Yeah. Y no es bueno porque cuando estás afuera 5 años, 6, 10 años, si no estás bien preparado you psicológicamente, no como, cambias, no tambor, no change, lengua, no danza, yeah. no identity and everything, y no, no, dance, no, y no rap, es bueno, no, no es bueno, no aprendes, no aprendes y te profesionaliza, yeah. pero learn, te desconecta mucho de, learn, guys, de tu cultura. From, uh, your own culture. Entonces, para mí es un sueño que que cumpliré seguramente más adelante. Otros de los sueños es poder, bueno, seguir viajando por yeah. diferentes no, partes del is mundo keep, keep, keep it, you know, the the y que mucha gente en el mundo conozca nuestra música, words, eh, ganar, music, ganar premios, reconocimientos, win, prime, you know. y por qué no hacer so algunos featuring why not? con why not? grandes artistas que nos inspiraron a nosotros. Sí, Dr. Dre, Kendrick Lamar, yeah. Snoop Dogg, you know. Fiji mm. entre otros. Sí, así que si de pronto no estáis aquí no aquí estudio oh man look they get it in man oh man I got so crazy crazy yeah record ahí voices rapear Aquí suto se cuida aquí tía lengua y palengue, hace mezcla aquí por racu bullerengue, tu tambora marimula tambo maraca y amaro, así na cuadronita te suena cabrón, sin trombón, cuya trompeta ni saxofón mantenemos la identidad de palengue y su tradición con el corazón, grande como el de Kiko, afroneto con my people para toda la nación. Combinator Records. Okay, okay. Oh man. For example, Jordan. Yeah. Question about Jordan. Number one. Number one. Come on. 
pero eh, el bueno LeBron. He's confused. He's no, 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 y que conozca nuestro trabajo, si me entiendes, porque hacemos parte de una misma gran familia en el mundo, si me entiendes. Así que siempre encontrarnos y conocernos siempre es bueno. Sí, es bueno. Así estamos en las redes sociales con Viles a mí, Instagram, Facebook, Spotify, iTunes, YouTube, ahí. Yo sí, de con Viles a mí. Got to get him on the on, you know what I mean? Sure, yes, sir. Gracias. Fila, fila, tarjeta. Oh, please, you know what to add that. You man, it's pretty yow, please. And then we are going to visit the place of the healers, the man who know about the traditional medicine, you know that. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. we're going to show you how we live. You know, mm -hmm. how they prepare their medicinal plants and all that, you know. So, so generally, uh, most people here are pretty healthy because, because of the healer. So no, no doctor? No, we have a doctor, not a doctor, you know. This is a, the, the healer we call the doctor too, because it's a man who now about the different medicinal plants. Right. About how to use the different medicinal plants, you know, that are different than how we use that. Right. You know, and we're going to see how he do everything. He's going to give a little information about the medicinal, you know, different than the Right. You know, yeah, we will see all about the traditional medicine. Okay. This is amazing, man. This is the place of the healer? Yeah. Hola. Hola. How you doing? Hola. How you doing? Nice to meet you. Nice Bienvenidos al espacio de medicina tradicional. Ante todo me presento, mi nombre es Pedro Reyes Miranda. Médico tradicional de la comunidad de San Basilio y Palenque. En nuestra comunidad no hay COVID-19. COVID Porque cuando el COVID-19 estaba en su auge mundial, world, nosotros a través de las plantas medicinales protegimos a nuestra comunidad. A través de té, a través de baños. Cero COVID, cero muerte. Zero COVID, zero died for COVID. En nuestra comunidad de San Basilio de Palenque, in community, in San Basilio de Palenque, este es el chocolatillo. We call this little chocolate plants. En combinación con la, con la flor de platanito. Y el anamú. La salvia. En nuestra comunidad, esto lo utilizábamos para prevención del COVID. Con esto hago un té. Este es la caña de mico. Esto lo utilizamos para purificar los riñones. 
y también sirve para personas que son diabéticos. Con esto puedo hacer un té o la puedo pelar y chuparla como si fuera una caña dulce, pero es amarga. Esta es la hoja de guanábana. Coquito morado. En combinación con el orégano. Orégano. En nuestra comunidad, esto lo utilizamos para el colesterol. Con esto hago un té y sirve para el colesterol. Este es la balsamina. Esto lo utilizamos para infecciones cutáneas de la piel. Y también sirve para parásitos intestinales. Con esto puedo hacer un té. O la puedo machucar. Y juntarle en la parte afectada. Este es ron compuesto. Esto lo utilizamos como antídoto. Sirve para mordedura de serpiente. Picadura de mosquito. Escorpio. Araña. También sirve para dolor de cabeza. También sirve para dolencia en el cuerpo. Esto es más de uso tópico. A diferencia de esta, tenemos una bebida más especial. Especia whisky palenquero. Esto lo utilizamos para purificar. Para proteger. Y también nos sirve como afrodisia. Similar a la mamaguana. similar a mamaguana bottle, si desea degustar so humano like mi, humano mi, poquito, I'm gonna um, try this drink right now. Uh, yeah, with, sure. You know, <laughs> I, I'm not sure what it's gonna taste like. I'm not sure what it's Hello. gonna do. But you feel like wait, wait, wait. You're playing. Hello. Hello. Like we ready? I, I nah, nah. We ready? It's like a hot cold, but this is a plane that gives a big part ah. of uh, flavor. Ooh. 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 Yeah. Gracias, huh? It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. In combination with that oil, a very special oil. Le dan poderes de protección a esos brazales. We give a big power of protection for those bracelets. Para qué lo utilizamos? Sirve para proteger nuestro cuerpo de mala energía. We protect our own body from bad energy. También lo utilizamos para la vida. No se usa para la vida. Para el amor. Para los negocios. Para la suerte. El cual va acompañado de un rezo de nuestro oricha. Go mix it with the typical pride that came from our oricha gods, South African gods. What? Rubbing the body, you know. Rubbing the body, yeah. Yeah, you bless me, right? Yeah, I got, I got, I got the blessing, right? Yeah, yeah, you ready, guys? I need that blessing. Oh, you go purchase it with the on African God now. Behind to you, cover, you know, against the every every bad energy, bro. Mm-hmm. Oh man. That was dope. <laughs> That's the way I love my community. I love oh my man, community. it smells so good too. Oh, man, you know, oh. I love my community. People say, "Yeah, hey, you can go live in Cartagena to work with us." I say, "No, man, I can't. I can't live." Right. I gotta show what. I gotta show the reality. I gotta show how we live. What's happening with the black people? What's happening with our own ancestor? What is happening with us in Australia? Yeah. I want to show. I, I like to show how we live. You know that. That is. Huh, you know that uh that kind of goes into maybe your purpose. You you're very, very good at doing this. 
I mean, like, <laughs> like very, very, very good at, do, at doing this. And, and we recommend by what's up, you know, man. Right, and then you know, and then kind of you know, when now I, I I'm a messenger of you now because now I could tell my experience from what I experienced to to other people. So it, it continues to travel on. Um, you say what? Well, he can't, he can't. Dice que gracias a ti ahora va a transmitir su mensaje. Look at that. That's good energy. Look at the good energy with a cane, bro. That's called money. That's what called money. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Is that what? There he is. Is he on me yeah. still? Yeah. Let's say that. Sometimes when he go out, he's going to go and bite you. He don't go and do nothing. Yeah, okay. I'm just going to leave him. When he go out, he's going to be free. I'm going to let him be. It is. The same blessing. You see, oh, no, he wanna go. Let, 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 let. Yeah, he got there. Oh, he. Yeah, he come back. That's what we call money. When we song, song thing like. The ladybug just jumped yeah. on. Yeah. <laughs> he said, "That's what they call money." Yeah. The, so as soon yeah, as that's, I, it's, that's it's, made me, that made me, that, that's made me proud. So as soon as soon as I walked out of the healer, boom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's the meaning of palanque right here. That's the meaning of palanque. Yeah. Okay. When here came the first 36, 30, 36 after the send the people who escaped from the hand of the European conquerors. What's a smaller village? And what surrounded by fences of wood like this one? That's the meaning. That's a special meaning of Palenque. That's the mean Palenque. Town surrounded by fences of wood. By fences by impalisate. That's the meaning of a Palenque word. Mm. So now we're going to visit the first world champion of boxing that gave Colombia. Ah, that's what I want to see. That was born here in this community. That's what I want to see. His name is Pambele. Pambele. The man with the power in the right hand. The man who brought the latest electricity. Yes. Maybe we're going to, to see a little bit inside the gym of boxing. Yeah. Do you know about... Um, Oh, guy, how he do to practice, you know, all the guys and everything. You know, he's trying to find another champion, world, world champion. This man was champion in the years 1972. Oh, okay, okay. Two, three, four years later, this man telling the TV and the radio, why I'm a champion, but why my community, my community don't have any electricity? And then the government starts to send many entity to put in a uh, two city right there you have the first world champion of boxing Pambele. Antonio Cervantes Reyes aka Kid Pambele. Pambele. The kid of Palenque. You know? How old is he now? You know he got like uh, 79. 79? Yeah. Hey. He was born like on uh, December 20 December 23. Without I think <laughs> something like this. Hoops here. Yeah, That's work right there. Yeah. Did y'all used to did y'all used to play here? Huh? Did y'all used to play here? Yeah, we play. We was playing here, but I didn't need to put a game the, the hoops in here. Yeah. Need new hoops. We need like a four dot because then we playing everybody. Yeah. Got, yeah. 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 All of them that want that that like the horse dunk that they going they going to show us. And they broke that. Right. They did it the same thing in the main square. Yeah. 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 Because they wanna dunk all the time, they wanna dunk. Ooh. Oh man. Yeah. Yes, sir. Why ain't nobody in here training right now? You know, I decided to retire. I say I, I was not ready about what I I was deserving in the box. No, I'm, you know, but then I say, you know, I'm going no more. Hey, hey. Uh, this. Yeah. I'm a partner and everybody tell me like, why you forget that shit? Come on, man. Why you forget that shit. You was my what was going. Uh. <laughs> Same guy, yes, sir. You don't have a new, a new popular box. But I say, nah, because they robbed it. They robbed money. But well, we deserve, we're like, white, like, like, Instagram. 
like uh, like uh, the boxer inside the national team. Mm -hmm. We not mercy back. Oh, we the serving. Hey, hey. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> Ask him where, where, the, where the box was at. Why the gym empty? Yeah, I feel okay. The gym is here. No, the gym is here. Principally, we are with kids, adolescents. We are with many children here too. And some guy like uh, 15 years old. The kids are from 8 or 9 years old. The kids, I, I mean, no, I start, you know, I begin to try and many kids from, you know, 7 years old, you know, you know, or until 15 years again. We pull, we try and another way then, you know, we could we want the day development. Y vamos proyectando a los niños van creciendo, le vamos haciendo procesos. We come and eh, make the process, you know. Selecciones Bolívar. Yes, and they go to participate in different departments, how different cities, you know, include another team, you know, show the power of Palenque, you know that. Right. Y hasta que lleguen en selecciones Colombia o peleen boxeo profesional. Because the idea is that they uh, become to be, you know, part of the national team of Colombia, and also if they wanna be professional boxers, they can do that too. Yeah. Okay. Bueno, estamos con con ese fin que tenemos ahora 34 niños yeah, practicando. Yeah, idea, we are 34 children training. You know. De mm -hmm. 9 años a 17 años, 18 años. From 9 years old until, you know, 70 years old, yeah. Mm. We have the children that have many dreams and want to be like Pambele. They are, they are following his step. They want to have that big power in the right hand, same thing. Yeah, and we, you know, he's, he's, he, he got that future now. He has the future of this community, the future of boxers. You know, many children come here around the four o'clock in the afternoon. They come here. I feel he many people showing, many guys showing his ability, you know. And showing him and he how big they how big in the world they can be. Yeah. You know, that's what they do. And that's what we like. Sometimes I come here to support them too. Yeah. I'm more, okay, keep going, you know, I like that, I like that too. Yeah. I just keep going, you know, that's, that's what I want, man. I want to see another champion, you know. I was part of the national team too, but I decided to retire. I was suffering, you know, something, social problem in my family, you know, like, you know, brother, you know, fighting by himself, I read by calling, you know, like, and I came. Say, you know, I, I was needing like a super um, um, family too. Like, I was needing to help my family sometime. I was, you no, know, you know, I was thinking, I was thinking sometime, like, I, 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 I'm not reciting what we deserve. I was feeling sometime like this and say, you know, when I, re I decided to retire to the boxing, when my, many people were saying, like, oh, you are nothing now. Mm. You are not now, and now I'm a cultural, now I'm a cultural history, guys. Right. And everybody say, oh, you are, wow, you learn English, how you do this, how you do, you know, you see? Because when you, when some door closes, some door closes, you got to keep going, trying to get another one, try to find another one, don't stop, never stop. Yeah, like when, yeah, yeah, exactly. When one door closes, it's another one that's gonna open right back up. It, it, it's, 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 it's inevitable, it has, it, it has to happen. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, it, like, it's, it's, it has to happen. It's, it's not one door closes and everything is the end. The only end is death. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As long as you live, yeah. you, I it's mean, it's something, it's something, you're gonna something, find you're gonna something, happen. absolutely, yeah. for sure. Because you are looking for, but you stay in the hall, you're not staying there. You're gonna find nothing. You are doing nothing. Right, right. Yeah, I'll keep it. I'll keep it now. And, and then the, uh, when when one door closes, that gives you the opportunity to grow. Yeah. To get better. Yeah, right? yeah. You know, so yeah, another. So, strong. Yeah. Put one strong. Okay. You close me too. Okay, I'm gonna keep going. Right. I right. know Lexi. I know Alexi, man. I know. I I I like to war. I like to do anything to to see my own people good. Right. It is. Right. Right, you, you're you're doing you're doing exactly what you're supposed to be doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, I I can tell. You know what? Nah, I can tell that right. What you what you do, 
you're supposed to be doing this. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Like, yeah. like, like, yeah. you're supposed. I'm doing it. Yeah, you're I'm supposed to be doing this. Yeah, like, yeah, I, mean, I, I, I can tell. Because I, 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 I'm separated from that boxing. My father, part of my brother, all of them pulled against me. Right. Why well, you retired? But I'm better. Too maybe tomorrow you can be better. I'm saying, you know, I want to give you something better. Right. You tell me that because uh, you don't live where I'm living now. You know, when I come in here, I'm oh, find problem because you are needing something to, to build something because you needed to buy some bed for your house. But I don't, I'm, I'm there, I'm there in the, in the national team. But I feel it. I don't really buy that good thing. They say that if you win, when you win some, I will give you right. some. But I say, why? But I, all the time I'm practicing, every time, every day I go traveling, fighting in all the parts. And the difference represent the Colombian team. You know, if you you got you got some you got you gotta find some medal. Right. Some medal, you gotta find some medal, anything. If you want something, you got some prize. And I I I, 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 I found I found some medal, national medal, different thing, but I say, wow, well, that's nothing. Yeah. If you don't fight it on the thing, you don't like I say, yeah, okay. I gotta go home. Yeah. I go and do, you know, another thing, you gotta like, you got resident many, 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 many pawns, you know. But they recognize, they, they recognize you was a good but you are a good boxing. But they don't give you what you deserve. Right. In most in most cases that that's with everything, right? Yeah. For the most you know, for the for the most part. Uh, here, I got a, I got a good question, right? Uh. What if somebody like a regular person wanted to move to, to Palenque? Could they move here? <laughs> <laughs> It's a big and a good process. Okay. The law, the law don't have that permission, the law for this community. Uh huh. Because we created the law yeah, that, you know, we was captured by the European conquer, and we we live with this mind. If somebody come to buy some little bit a little piece of uh, uh, backyard, some ground here, the law is playing, they gone to, they come to live here. But maybe we are going to the the loud thing to speak about like it. Where they they will come more like more people, and more people going to come here. More people, their family, and they going to live more here. And go and we're going to be losing fail to fail on our land, and we're going to be like losing a little bit of our own custom because they come from the north side to encode them. And right, and yeah, it's a, and they they bring their stuff into yeah. in, into this. Yeah. So, so everybody that lives here is actually from here. Yeah, it's from here. Some people have trouble in a different city. They marry. They get married with another. Okay. Another ladies, white women, you know. Right. And then some of them bring the women. That is the way you would see some people mixes. And right. Stuff like that. But that's that. That's the only way. Yeah. That's the only way. That's the only way. Yeah, it's the only way. Yeah, because if somebody comes to here to leave and to buy some buyer without without the permission, the permis the permission of the uh, own leaders, mm -hmm. they can lose the ground. Thank you for, for taking me around and, get, and, and giving me all the information. Cause I really here to learn. So I so somebody told somebody else told me I didn't know anything about Palenque before before I came to Cartagena. Didn't know anything yeah, yeah, yeah. about Palenque. A friend said you need to go to Palenque, and that's why I reached out. And uh, like I said, this is something that's, I, I think this is something personally that every descendant needs to come and, and experience. To come here, you kind of put life in a perspective and to see how people live as a community with no police running around and with guns or anything like that. And you see people of our color living amongst each other. And I mean, it's, it's just, it's a great community. You know, and that's what that's what it's really, really about is community. And this is an example that it can be done. Uh, yeah, it's, you know, it's <laughs> it's crazy, man. It's crazy. It's, to, it's crazy to experience it. And I feel like su super blessed yeah, to be able to have you. Know I what I'm saying? What I told you is thank you for coming. You know. Thank you for everything. Thank you more. That's the truth. That was a great moment where I shared it with you. Too, brother you know with the idea to learn our own people my own people our own black people don't live by another places you know to learn all those people is like a, to 
share of our, our African heritage. And I wonder that all the people now, now that I'm here in Colombia, we have a one Africa out of Africa named Palenque. Yeah. The first village of the America. Right. So if somebody wanna come to enjoy that great experience here in Palenque, you will be welcome in my community. <laughs> all right. This episode of Citizen of the World is sponsored by All Dreams. Believe and achieve all dreams. And this is what All Dreams is all about. Look, somebody didn't dump, took the, took the, took the joint down. Yeah. Young guys like to play basketball out here. We have a group in the, in the internet. Hey, we're going to play today. Everybody come in tonight, 7 o'clock, everybody here. Yeah. Jordan Tour and everything. Like, <laughs> we're going to play. All Dreams is about making impact in any way we can, small or big. And if I see a need or have an idea through connecting with the people that I meet, I want to take action. While in Palenque, I seen that the basketball hoops were all torn down. And what I want to do is I want to buy new sturdy outdoor basketball hoops for the village. Purchase our All Dreams Juneteenth Big Elephant Dreams hoodie to contribute. And I will make a video when we purchase and install the hoops in Palenque. So welcome to Palenque, the first free village of the America. Palenque, the first town, the first free village of the America. Nuestra música habla de los diferentes temas sociales, culturales. Different social things. It's my job. It's, a, it's like a, a big deal, you know? Seems like it's a... So is this a, a town or a village? 